Tonight, a follow-up to our special report on teen dating violence that you saw here last night on the Night Beat. Now, an El Paso psychologist touched by the worst kind of violence is working to make sure that teens everywhere get the information that they need to stay safe. Felipe Solis has more on the story. Jennifer Ann Crescente was an 18-year-old honor student at a high school in Austin, Texas, when she was shot and killed by a former 19-year-old boyfriend the day after Valentine's Day of this year. Her grandmother, El Paso psychologist Dr. Betty Richardson, and her son, Jennifer Ann's father, have turned Jennifer's death into a mission to help other teens. His personal goal, as is mine, is to prevent any other victims like this. Jennifer Ann's group is now a nonprofit organization designed to tell this teen's story, to sell trinkets of love to honor Jennifer Ann and to use the proceeds for education, even scholarships. This is not just educating young women about for, you know, avoidance of violence. This is about educating young men about alternative behaviors to violence. Dr. Richardson is also working with the American Psychological Association and the Texas branch with a warning signs campaign as well as a stand against violence. Bad words, bad touches, these are unacceptable from the very beginning because these things do escalate. If you'd like more information for your teen to learn more about healthy relationships, log on to the website at jenniferann.org. Felipa Solis on the Nightbeat.